all of my new subscribers say yeet unsubscribe hi welcome to the reading corner my channel it's the vg what does the G stand for? The G stands for God awful slogan that I started and now I can't stop. It's just like watching a new show on Netflix or Miley Cyrus. Um, so I, 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 I went on my channel and um, fit, fit? 50,000 subscribers? Ah, uh, yeah. Owen Wilson says, wow, that's pretty good. I would like to thank my mother for um, giving birth to me. <laughs> the YouTube algorithm. So, my last video was about a Wattpad fanfic turned into a book, best selling, um, turned into a movie. And you know what? It was just a little bit too hot for my liking. So um, in this video, because fifty thousand subscribers, we're having a little bit of a treat. Um, yeah, we're we're upping the gay on on this video um, by a lot. Um, we're gonna be designing really trashy looking gay erotic covers. If you're a new subscriber, uh -huh, you're in for a treat. <laughs> I bring all the bees you know the banter the 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 books um the the bee movie <laughs> Boop. so yeah let's just dive right in okay so like any good project um and like Big Sean featuring Ariana Grande said in the gospel and the most underrated Bible verse to ever exist, created in 2015 in his album. These hoes be doing research. Research, research. I swear she's like, this piece of hair off in the sink ain't come from me first. Hell no. We're gonna go to the most reliable source to ever exist, um, BibleGateway.com. Oh, oh God! Would you look at that? Three hundred and twenty-one friend requests. Wow, I can't, I can't even count it. Three hundred and twenty-one. Honestly, I know that my Goodreads link is in the description below, but I literally never go on Goodreads. Because I don't read. I think the fact that I've had this long ass running joke that I'm a booktuber who doesn't read, it's not even funny anymore. It's actually not even a joke. How am I gonna sit here calling myself a booktuber and my, my reading challenge was one. I have read five books out of my goal of one. <laughs> um, oh my, I mean, come on though. I'm, if you. I'm overachieving. If, okay, if my channel had a weather report, it would it would be like says extended dry spells could be the new normal. That is historic. Here is where we are today, barely registering anything. For the most part, seen a lot of drought in recent years. For the last 17 years, two decades almost. <laughs> Just like my love life. The fact that I'm a booktuber who doesn't read is 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 it's an oxymoron, yeah. Look like an ox and act like a moron. Okay, gay romance. Fine genre, thank you. Yep, you can like, I'm, I'm, I'm only 12 books in. I can already see a theme. Um, it's just a bunch of shirtless men. It just angers me, okay? Like, at least try to match like the colors. Like, I can't tell with these covers. Like, what is actually serious and what is real i feel like peter malark right now i'm just going real or not real real so i was like yeah divya you should do like a day in the life um i would do a day in the life except for the fact that it would be kind of boring because every day just nothing ever happens this is atrocious. Actually, I feel I feel sick. Look at his hand. Where is his hand? Is it down his pants? Is it just blended away? Is it he? Oh, Mr. Stark, I, I'm feeling 
So good. Yeah, let's have like a beach background, you know, get, the sand can get up all up in their crevices. Let's go to the beach, each, let's go get away. Oh, actually, the worse it looks, the better. Just don't even try, just stretch it. But actually, it pains me. Skinny legend, yeah, the tree? Okay, and then what else do we need? Shirtless men. We need some type of shirtless... What the switch when you look at this and you look at like oh my god this is literally this is like a metaphor for me over Christmas holidays you know I come to uni I do a lot of walking as soon as Christmas comes <laughs> expanding horizontally but not vertically we need to up the gay on this channel oh okay but <clears throat> Okay, hear me out, yeah? You can't be sitting there telling me that when you saw Voldemort in a suit, you didn't look at him and think, wow, what a deal. You know, you tell me you didn't look at that shiny, smooth, gradient egg head and think, I'd love to lick that master of Voldemort, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? What I mean? <laughs> yeah, this video is about to be demonetized. <laughs> Transformers, robot in disguise. We are like a bad boy, don't we? Not a murderer, though. I am so tempted to put like a member of EXO on here. Oh boy! Okay! Who is? Who is? Who is? Huh? Oh, sorry, I'm, I'm just doing- I'm just doing research. Actually, you know who's actually allergic to shirts? It's um, the Rulo. I mean... I mean... Oh, okay, for now, we'll just stick to, you know, Jen, February, March, April, May, June, Jason, Devulo. Boop. Hi. Oh, my battery ran out and then it just got dark. Didn't know I was going through puberty. But we shall continue. Anyway, where were we? Oh, yes. Jason, Devulo. We literally have Cadbury bar pecs. You could grate cheese on these pecs and since we are on this topic of gayness um i'll tell you a little fun fact a little fun story about myself so when i was born in nepal the witches in nepal cursed me they left me with a curse where basically everyone that i've ever had a crush on ever is gay Okay, first of all, point and case, the most prominent gay of them all that I've ever had a crush on, um, Troy Sivan, Connor Franta, um, Dan Howell. The thing is, like, if I have a crush on someone, they're either gonna be gay or they're gonna be some type of gay somewhere. Um, any cute boys that I see in the club and I think, oh, they'll be cute. Gay. Sometimes people message me on Instagram or on Twitter or even in my YouTube comments and I look at the icon and I'm like, oh, a little bit cute. Let me let me do a little bit of um, creepy stalking and um, gay. And then the one time it's not a dude and I do want this to be gay, it turns out they're not even gay. Um, um, anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, the fact that they're gay, it doesn't even matter because it's not like it's gonna affect any prospects at all whatsoever even if they weren't gay because okay <laughs> these little fan girls these 12 rules especially with like k-pop especially and the fact that they feel so entitled whenever their favorite is like in a relationship and then they send them death threats and they're like oh my god i can't believe you stole my man <laughs> it's like girl um, okay, these actors, these idols, they're sitting out here in their own private jet, 
first class ticket and you're I'm sorry, you're in the economy seat, you know? Stay in your seat. Some fans act so childish, like y'all need baby monitors, okay? Y'all need booster seats. Posture, right? So like ever since doing computer science, I fully have nerd neck. Okay, I have nerd neck and my back. I'm about to look like the hunchback of Notre Dame by the time I'm 23. Literally, I, I sat at the computer like, like this, like, like. <laughs> Coding. I don't like the beach background, actually. I feel like it's just random. Oh, Lord, this is not what I wanted. He's into the dark arts, you know? Master of multi rolling. You know, sometimes a little bit of a saucy snake. Sometimes a master of dark arts, you know? Sometimes looking like marinated chicken i can't decide on a title for this we, we have two options we could have um riding solo because it's jason derulo Ooh. or we could have something like um something voldemort related you know something he made my wand levitate Oh, we need a really ugly font. It was at this moment when Divya's camera battery died and she didn't notice but continued to make bad jokes that no one should ever have to endure. One of the jokes was about being horny and therefore logically to conclude as a result of this ergo consequently, thus, hence. A triceratops. Ha. The sand is about to get all up in their eyes, nose and lips. I called this one he was a triceratop. Here are the erotic covers. If the designers don't try, then neither will I. Amazing. Subscribe. Please. Feed me. Okay, thank you for sticking around. That's it. Content. Yeet.